Education Minister Nancy Allen officially opened Morris School's new auto body and welding shop Thursday afternoon in appropriate fashion. The new state-of-the-art facility, which cost the province almost $4 million, consists of over 10,000 square feet of classroom and shop space. Allen says the centre will foster skills that allow students to find employment close to home. Well, this is an incredible uh, state-of-the-art uh, silver lead facility that is going to provide opportunities for young people uh, in four school divisions. And it's going to be a real opportunity for young people to get uh, apprenticeship opportunities as well. And uh, it's going to get them good jobs. She also announced a partnership with Red River Valley School Division to purchase and install a new paint booth for the facility. Harv Giesbrick, director of the Red River Technical Vocational Area, says the new building is a major upgrade. Bright, airy space, great uh, air makeup units and air quality for the students as they're studying, and uh, in-floor heat to keep the place uh, warm and give uh, students a warm surface to work off of. Uh, We've got a fair bit of uh, new uh, state-of-the-art equipment in our welding and metal fabrication area, and uh, the the auto body program, we've installed a, a downdraft paint booth there as well, so that uh, students get to work with the uh, the latest technology that's available in the industry. Giesbrick says about 60 students will pass through the new facility this year. He thanks ratepayers in the Red River Valley School Division for standing behind the project. Uh, We have students coming out of these programs that are employed throughout the region, and uh, they've become very successful business owners in their own right, or they're uh, you know, very responsible in responsible positions in a lot of our manufacturing facilities. And uh, just, you know, it helps students uh, find their place, find their way in, in life. For Pemina Valley Online, I'm Corey Canute.